Good morning, this is Bob. Been finishing up the Paraset here. Got it mounted in the case. Got everything calibrated. There's my calibration chart there. I just calibrated the spots for the crystals that I have. Made the clips for the tubes here. This is a packing strap from a big package came years ago. I don't think they use that metal stuff anymore like that. And it's real easy to set it up and get it going. All closes up nicely into the box now. And uh, you want to get on the air here. You just put your tubes in. This one you will notice here is a 6SJ7. Seemed to work a little better in the audio stage. So I left it in there. I was trying some different ones. Connect the antenna. Now instead of headphones, I'm going to use uh, computer speakers. And last thing we do is connect the power. And now we turn on the power supply. The regeneration seems to work really good at a rather sharp point there. I took this uh, phones out and I'll pull the power plug on it here and turn it off. Oh, I was going to show you here. Uh, then you want to go to transmit. Let's see here. I've got a uh, got a bunch of adapters here. Let's put our uh, speaker back in there. Now we just go to transmit with the transmit receive knob here. And there we're transmitting. That's not a number 47 bulb, that's a 313, and it takes uh, 5 watts to light a 313 to full brilliance. So we're in about 3 watts here right now. I can get 4 watts out when I tune it carefully. But uh, that's the project here. It's coming along really nice, and uh, just really happy with the way it's working. The labels were made with the uh, uh, label maker that I got from uh, Hobby Lobby and it has these white labels with black letters. I thought it worked out really good. So that's it guys. Got the project completed here. Now I can operate on the air. I did have a nice QSO for about a half an hour with the station in Mount Airy, Maryland last night. That was with it still laying on the bench, not in the case yet. So uh, be real nice to take it out in the backyard on a sunny day and uh, throw an antenna over the tree and operate like the uh, like they did back in World War II behind the uh, enemy lines. 73's and good DX.